There's the whistle. Let's get the call for the officials. The Lions will lose a man tripping the call. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. An opportunity here to go up by one on the power play. You know they've worked on this in practice. It's something you do, your repetitions. This is what prepares you to be big in these moments. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Here's the chance to clear the puck from his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Kicked up ahead to his teammate who skates away. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Quick pass to Kubitschek. And that's a great hits up play by Torrey. Puck cleared from the defensive end. The Admirals gain possession. And he takes the feed. Great heads up play with the stick by Thomas. Well, Riviere's got a hold of it along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Martin. The Lions get a hold of the puck under man. And they manage to clear it. And he hangs on to the puck. Knocked away by McLean. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. The Lions preserve the lead as their penalty killers get the job done. Well, and you have the player advantage and you're down by a goal. You have to... Oh, the save of the play! What an incredible save. No idea how we got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Sends a pass over. Rebetic's last save is one that's going to be remembered for a while, James. It's going to be on the highlight reel. It's on one of mine now. I mean, he stole one there. It was all but in, and that desperation and compete level, it makes the save. More than half the period has expired. Trois Riviere's up one zip. The Admirals come up with the defensive zone draw. Kubitschek swooping in on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Verbenich. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to Verbenich. Stones on with the blocker. Poked away in the offensive end. Norfolk's carrying the puck deep inside their own zone. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. Switch. 
Whoops in and grabs the puck with the centers tied up in the scrum on the draw. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? Shot right in front. No room for that one to get through. Turns it aside. The Admirals have it against the wall. Norfolk's got it in their own zone. Great reach by Gay. Knocks the puck loose after a solid hit. Boy, his determination on the puck, even though he stumbled and has a lack of balance, really shows right there, James, as he finds a way to get that pass through to the shooter. Yeah, refs don't like that. There's the whistle as the net comes off. You really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level when you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game. You know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Past the midway mark of the frame, the Lions have taken a 1-0 lead. The Admirals win the draw. Drives to the sweet spot and it scores! It's in the back of the net, and it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. Well, he's been relentless, James, in this playoffs, and you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates. Well, this is a play it looks like they worked on practice. You get the win, and then the quick-release shot buries it home. Getting into the later stages of this period. We got a tie game. Beauregard's won the draw at center. The Lions have it now. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Quick shot. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a piece of that one. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Beauregard's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Too many bodies in the way. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Admirals will play it in their own end. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Norfolk's going to start with the puck in their own end. The Admirals move the puck in the defensive zone. Here's an odd man rush. Turned aside by the goaltender. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, now they're in front, James, so they'll have some energy. You know that their first few strides will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. Well, you don't get many odd man rushes throughout a game, James. You have to capitalize on your opportunity. I thought they executed perfectly. They didn't overpass. The right player took the right shot. Norfolk's got in front by a goal here in the first. Well, I really like the way they've competed here, James. They get the go-ahead goal, but they got to find a way to continue to attack. you got to play with killer instinct, especially when there's so much time left. Beauregard's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. Moves it quickly over to Bogany. Great read on the block. Puck battle along the boards. Slides it over with pace to Martin. Blocked in traffic. Puck scooped up by McLean. The Lions scoop it up along the boards. Trois Rivieres got possession here in the offensive zone. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end. Picked up along the boards. And he takes the feed. Shot! Oh, what a stop on the play! Back at the point, he set it up. Denies him! Oh, and he comes up with a big stop there! What a sequence. I mean, he has been outstanding making consecutive saves. I mean, his defense, they gotta start playing. Norfolk's coaches wanted a lot of shots on net, and the team has delivered so far, leading late in the first. The Admirals win the faceoff. Skates to the crease! Moves the puck. Oh. 
First 20 minutes of play is in the box. Both teams get a chance to refresh and reset. We'll be back with second period action in no time. Are you a super fan? Here's your chance to prove it. If you have the best decorated car or home, you And the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? Marco, it's playing real well, and they need to continue to push the pace and continue on from that first period where they established a one-goal lead and they had majority of shots on net. We're still in the early stages of this period. Norfolk's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. The Lions get a hold of the puck in their own end. Up along the wing. Big play inside the defensive zone. And they're going to be shorthanded once again, much to the chagrin of these fans. What is that? Is that three in a row now? Yeah, that's three in a row. You got it. And the fans certainly don't like it, but it's not up to them, is it? But now they're back to the PK. So difficult to get any kind of flow in a game when you're marching to the penalty box. The Admirals once again send out their power play unit. Power plays, more time on the ice, the ability to get that puck moving. These players know exactly what they're doing. They work on it in practice, spoke to some of them earlier today at the pregame, and they talked about the execution and the precision in particular with their puck movement. And there's another stop! Goodness, he kept the 102! They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Norfolk's got a hold of the puck now. The Admirals will have one last chance to move the puck up here on this power play. Fires it on net, and there's a blocker stopped by Verbenich. Well, Rivier is back to even strength. Nice job to escape the zone. Power plays dictate games, and this one did not, and the coach will not be happy with the setup or the opportunity that this unit gave them. The Admirals are across the line and into the offensive end. Oh, tremendous reflexes with the pad. What a stop by Verbenich. I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Norfolk's been the more impressive team offensively, and they continue to lead here in the second. Sends the cross-ice pass. Trois-Rivières got a hold of the puck. The Lions played along the boards. Grabs possession of the puck. Jostling for the puck, but still maintains possession. McLean stick handling in his own zone. Norfolk's on the attack. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Fournier's got it in the defensive end. The Lions looking against the half wall. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Roy. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Trois Riviere is looking to break out. Here they come up along the wing. Puts it on net. Scores! And the rookie gets his first playoff goal. Well, it's so important to manage the expectation and the nerves when you're a rookie, and that goal is going to do nothing but give him confidence. Well, there's not much time here before the goaltender's eyes are taken away, James, and he drops into that butterfly position. All you want to do when you can't see the puck is make yourself as big as possible, but this one has seeing eyes through traffic and finds the back of the net. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We are all tied up in this one. The Lions win the draw here in the neutral zone. Norfolk's got it in their own zone. Reaches out and uses the stick. Break away! Makes the save! Oh, and this is a great save, James. The goaltender gets to the top of the streets, makes himself look huge, and is extremely aggressive to be able to make that stop. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Back 
left underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to No. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Poked away by Filio. Oh, puts a glove on it to make the stop. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Admirals win that offensive zone faceoff. That's using the body on the block. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Another stick infraction, and you know that coaches don't like this one. A product of not being in good position, reaching, and then taking the trick because you weren't moving your feet. Opportunity on their first power play of the game, James. And this is an opportunity to look at the coverage as well. See how they're playing it, whether they're going to be aggressive or sit back. Play with the dead penalty coming up. Anytime you lose position on your opponent, this can happen. He gets the sticks out in the feet of his opponent, and guess what? He gets the tripping call. Opportunity here for them. They'll have plenty of time to work this five on three. Oh, and that is a lot of time on a five on three. You have to have a sense of urgency here, though, because if you pop one by, you still have the man advantage. Montgomery's gliding in for the face off as this penalty kill will continue. Beauregard's won the draw. Moves it to Parker Jones. Here's a chance! Comes up with a monster save in front. Well, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. job by this PK unit, James, creating some momentum for their team and getting out of it without getting scored on. And this is critical, given that it's a tie game. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Norfolk's got the puck in the defensive end. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Beauregard's got it in the offensive end. Here's a shot. And he comes up with the glove save. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Caddick's won a big draw in their own end. The Admirals will play it from the defensive zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. Well, has got the puck inside the defensive zone. Oh, he couldn't put it past. What a stop by Verbenich. We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that club save. Late goings of this period. It's all tied up. Robidas won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. And he gets in the lane to block that. Norfolk's got it into the offensive zone. Hammers one at the net. The nice on the front. The Lions gain control of the puck against the wall. Robidas got it in the own. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Oh, to Madison with the power save. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Trois Riviers won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Snaps one here on the slot. Came up 
but the save on that play. The man's taken along the wall. Takes a slow shot from the point. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Lions take possession here inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Kelly. Slides the puck over to No. Warrior's got it in the neutral zone. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Dorian. And he shut the door on that last play. This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. Gaze crossed the line and gained the zone. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Oh, what a smart heads-up play. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Please don't throw any objects on or towards the playing surface at any time during the game. The throwing of any objects is the The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. Well, time to find out who wants this one more as we are up in the third. a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Down the right side and into the zone. Here's a short pass to Thomas. Shot! And that oh, he had that corner, but he puts it off the outside of the post. The Lions looking to break the tie here, and they bring another one off the post. So frustrating, James. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point-blank range. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. Martin's got it along the wing. Well, Rivière's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Martin. Carroll's got the puck in his own zone. The Admiral's played along the wing. Angles it over to Kirk. Here's a shot. Oh, and he had the answer on that one. Martin's got a hold of the puck behind the net. Quick feed to Beauregard. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Cuts to the paint. Passes it over to Noah. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Here's a shot. Glove save. For Pettit just got the puck, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Well, and this is a huge play right here. It's recognizing the tempo of the game and being able to dictate it. He's done it all night. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We got a tie game. Hayes won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Trois-Rivières well, going on the attack as they gain the zone. Shot! Oh, he gets a piece of the puck to the diamond. Kubitschek's moving the puck through his own zone. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Back to the point it goes. Turns it aside with the glove. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. Hayes, quick stick off the draw, wins possession. The Lions take it along the wing. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. The Lions gain possession along the wall. Denies him! What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Drives it to the crease! Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, and this has been trending to happen. Goes along the puck quickly, he sends an upward trajectory as his games progress and they find the back of the net. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. 
The Lions pick up the go-ahead goal here in the first half of this third period. What's the strategy now here, Cheryl? Well, you know, I, I think they've gotten to this point because they've held the possession time, James. They haven't panicked. They've had good patience with the puck. I think they've got to continue that, and they may find the back of the net again. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. A chance in front. A blast! Fukovic has got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been outstanding all game, James. He's the reason why his team is leading in this one and elects with a good decision to get the face off. Face off looming as both centers get into position. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Slides it on over to Novak. Into the offensive end now. Shot! Denies him with a pass save. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. The Lions will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Scooped up along the wall by Ducharme. Novak's hauled down. Penalty on the way. Fires to the crease. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. you got to find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. Well, Rivier has got another opportunity here on the man advantage. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. Rips it! Denies him with a save! Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Montgomery side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Norfolk's won the draw. Clearing attempt. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Feeds the cross ice pass to Wah. Looking to break out here on the power play. The Lions have it now. Goes right to the crease. Oh, a save on the play. Wow. Oh, that's grand larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Montgomery is ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. The Lions run out of time on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, everyone has a job and a role to do, and guess what? It's about DK execution right now. They have the one goal lead. Now they're protecting it. The Admirals send their man advantage unit out once more. A power play then can even the score here, James. It is massively important that they create some kind of momentum in their favor on this one. Shuts them down. Norfolk sliding the puck behind the net. Here's a rocket of a shot. And that somehow stayed out of the net. And the puck clears the zone. And it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads up play there. Well, Riviera has gained possession along the boards. Takes it to the front and makes the save. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. The Admirals cross the line and gain the zone. He grabs the puck here at the point. Trois Rivieres penalty killers come up with a monstrous effort. The next shift is critical, James. They had the opportunity on the power play to get back in it and get the equalizer. Now they're down by one, so they have to manage some energy here, and they have to dictate pace and get back in the game. Nice zone entry from the right side. And he slides it quickly to Kadic. On the attack along the boards. Pass back to the point. Scores! His first of the playoffs, and the rookie gets it done. Well, every athlete wants to establish themselves as a playoff performer. Well, the rookie, an impressive start to leaving a lasting impression. 
I'd like to call this a quiet shot, James. What that means is the goaltender can't see it. So he's listening for it, and it buzzes right by him because he cannot catch up to it, can't find it with his eyes, and can't find it with his body. The Admiral's last goal, Cheryl. Huge. It is massive, isn't it? And the timing is impeccable. Right at the end of the game, you find a way to get the equalizer, and this really puts the opponent on their heels. It tightens up their sticks, so they have to attack and find a way to get to the net. Takes the feed. Shot and a save. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. And that'll free up the puck. Fires it. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Takes a shot. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. Norfolk's got a hold of it against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Norfolk's got the puck along the wall. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. What a block as he lays out in front of it. Takes the pass. Into the attacking end. Takes the shot. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Here's a pass down low. And now he moves it quickly to Mary Say Ortiz. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Picked up along the wall by Beauregard. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Quite the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Who wins? Carter Bay has heard it. regulation hockey and it's been a tense one here tonight and guess what the intensity is going to ramp up to another level because sudden death overtime is coming up and they are ready to drop the puck here in OT looking for heroics here as they get underway in overtime Takes the dish. And that goes off a stick and off to the side. Passes the puck over to Wong. Moves it around along the half wall. Keeps it out. Got a piece of it with the trappers. Handles the pass. Makes his presence known on the ice. Was taking it from his own end. Inside the offensive zone. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Norfolk's got it from behind the net. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Martin's lugging the puck. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Great read with the stick. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. The Lions will play it in their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Quick shot! Oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out! Here's a shot, and he comes up with a stop there. Headman pass. Was going to play it against the half wall. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. The officials will pass the sentence here. Well, the coach didn't feel this was warranted. It wasn't egregious enough during overtime to call it, but it is a penalty. This is an urgent kill. The Admirals once again send out their power play unit, and what a golden opportunity here. What a time in this game to have a power play opportunity.
opportunity in overtime. The coaching staff has to settle their team down, make sure they're ready to go here so they can execute and capitalize. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? Gaze won the draw deep in the defensive zone. He says, let's get physical on that play. Pass out front. Takes a blast. And another stop. The Lions will kill off a few extra seconds now. And the puck leaves the zone. Dumps the puck in. Norfolk's got the puck along the boards. The Admirals have time for one last rush here on this power play. And it's a quick pass to Kubitschek. Norfolk's, here's a chance! Tremendous play for the team as he blocks it. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. There's the whistle, let's get the official decision. Everyone has a role on the team, and this PK unit right now in overtime has to do a job if they want to remain in the game. And a man advantage unit goes right back to work. Oh, James, I'm surprised. The ref made that call. A power play in overtime. This is exactly what you want when you're a big player. You want that puck on your stick with a chance to be the overtime winner. Chance the puck away. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Thomas works the puck in his own zone. Moves it to Martin. Gains the zone through center. Here's a shot. And he comes up big with the stick save. Getting all of it with the paddle. Good heads up play to the defensive zone. Denies that opportunity. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Trois Rivier is going to be hard-pressed to find better opportunities to win it than that as they come up empty-handed with the power play. Well, that's a deflating one, James. Power play in overtime, and you don't execute. You can see the bench right now. They were standing. Now they're all sitting. And he takes the pass. Here they come on the attack down the left side. For the win! Oh, we are still tied! What a stop! Trois Riviers on the attack. Puck grab.